Yankees and tied for second in the league, but he's saying no to the home run derby. The reason his father, Ron Harper, would have thrown to Harper, his son Bryce, that is, but that won't happen because of Ron's recent rotator cup surgery. He pitched to his son Bryce back in 2013. Bryce came in second, so it worked somewhat. He did say he hopes to participate in future home run derbies after his father recovers. I'm not worried about that. I'm, I'm worried about him enjoying the process and enjoying the experience of being there. Um, he, you know, he was a top vote getter. That's an honor. So to go and participate in whatever he can participate or wants to participate in, certainly up to him and we're behind him all the way. All right, well, in tennis, it was Williams versus Williams in the fourth round at the Wimbledon. Before today, Serena led the series with her sister 14 to 11. Today, the battle. It was the 26th time, and Serena broke Venus's serve right away and took control. She won the first set 6-4 using her ground strokes, and those are deadly, by the way. She wore down Venus in the second set to win 6-4, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. Okay, well, Rory McIlroy might not be able to defend not one, but two major titles this year. He shocked the golf world when he posted a pic on Instagram. Uh, he was on crutches. He wrote that he sustained a total rupture of an ankle ligament. It happened when he was playing soccer with some friends in Northern Ireland. He also said in his post, rehab has already started, working hard to get back as soon as I can. We wish him a speedy recovery. All right, can't get enough of this. Team USA took World Cup number three. And a big thanks goes to Carly Lloyd, undoubtedly the team's MVP. She had a hat trick in the World Cup final, including this ridiculous shot from midfield. When does that happen? Yeah. Well, that was the first hat trick in women's World Cup final history. And since they have three World Cups, they'll have three stars on their jerseys in the next four years. And a final note, Mono Ginobili re-signs with the Spurs for next season. And sources say David West also signed with the San Antonio Spurs. They just keep on racking up. Yeah. Keep on racking them up. There you go. That World Cup was like a Tyson fight. Oh, my God. Go, go get a beer. You come back, it's over. Exactly. Boy. The latest, sir. Well, a couple scattered showers out there. Let's check out our storm scan. Most of the heavy-duty action well to the west, but a couple showers and storms possible tonight. They'll diminish, and then tomorrow looks like we could have a rain-free day near 91 degrees. Hot sunshine. Brian Vandegraaff in tonight at 11 to give you more. Sounds good. And World News Tonight with David Muir coming up next. See you here at 11. Thanks for watching ABC 7 News. Winner.